Good evening, everybody, and welcome back to uh, the Pokemon Pucky, uh, Pucky, Puppy playthrough. Uh, so, last time I did, like, cut this off a little bit because, you know, medicine was making me feel a bit drowsy. So I did find out what was going on with that. I'm not getting sick again. It's, um, so after someone has the flu, they can get, like, uh, post-viral symptoms. And the main one that I'm having is a cough. A uh, really bad cough, honestly. Did I heal my Pokemon? Yes, I did. I'm going to go train a little bit. Um, so I got this pretty decently bad cough. Okay, I was still running. I don't know why my character stopped. Uh, I got a pretty bad cough. And I, I basically learned that it's just going to happen for a while. I just got to take some medicine to <clears throat> prevent it from happening. That's about it. There we go. <coughs> Sorry about that. Oh, I just gotta take some medicine to prevent it from happening. This time I took. Uh, this time I took medicine that was not as effective. That way I would be more here and active for this. Um. So I might cough a couple times throughout this. I also have a cough drop, so you know. Just trying to do what I can to... <clears throat> <clears throat> Sorry. To still be able to stream. Uh, I think it was, what, 70 that I decided that I had to get to? Give me one quick sec. Yep, 70 is where I decided that I had to go. Which... Let me check my Pokemon. Yeah, I'm pretty close. Um, oh, you, I haven't battled you yet. I ran past you, I remember that. <clears throat> so I'm hoping that this training part here won't take very long. And... The only problem with Smeargle is that it has to actually be able to use its moves. Oh. Maybe that's why I wasn't running into anything in the cave. Ah, oh, that, that's probably why I wasn't running into anything in the cave up there. I didn't realize that I had a repel on. I don't remember why I had a repel on. <clears throat> oh, so. Just to give people an update, because I talked about it last time. Uh, so, last time I played. I think I was at something like 700 something for um, the the national decks in just like me trying to complete it. Uh, I am at I think it's like 830 now, 838 or something, um, <clears throat> which has been great. The only problem that I'm facing is. I, so, for people who don't know, a little while back, I'm going to say a couple years ago, actually, now that I think about it, uh, is there any Pokemon in here? Yes, there is. Okay, good. Um, my Switch actually got ruined, 
so all of my save data got deleted. Which part of that save data was um some Pokemon that you can't get again. So because they were like event Pokemon. Uh <clears throat> I am doing my best to get everything back, but I don't think there was ever another event for Deontzi. Uh, what was it, Volcanion? I feel like there's one more that I need to get. Hoopa. Oh, why did I do that? Um, <clears throat> so here's the thing, Hoopa is, is something that um, you can get in Pokemon Go, which I do play and that has actually really helped me complete the Pokedex. The problem is you can't transfer Hoopa out of uh, Pokemon Go. It's just, you know what, I'm gonna actually, give me a sec, you guys are gonna see that, uh... I'm just going to increase the emulation speed here. Just while we're uh, doing the training, I'm going to increase the speed. I hate these guys. <clears throat> nice. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, so you, you can't transfer Hoopa out of Pokemon Go, which means it's just one that I don't have until they change that. I don't know why you can't transfer it out of Pokemon Go. That's really weird to me. But, you know, whatever. Uh, luckily, stuff that I can transfer out of Pokemon Go, I have a Meloetta in that. I have Mew, and I have uh, Zarude, or Zarud. I'm not entirely sure how to pronounce that one. <clears throat> Open to corrections. Oh, well. I love how you can't see their levels when they faint. Thank you. Pokemon 68, 68, 68, 68. Nope. I should see what items I actually put on a bunch of these guys. I just realized I have... What's up, Marpak? How are ya? It's been a while since I've seen ya. I haven't caught any of your streams in a while either. I'm sorry about that. Oh, why haven't you streamed in a while? Just been busy or something? Ooh, 
Oh. Uh, they're going pretty good. <clears throat> I finished up my Nuzlocke. That was pretty fun. Started a Discord. And thank you for trying to... Yeah, I got a Discord server now. I believe... Oh, I haven't set that up yet. I need to do that. Uh, it sh should be linked. I have not... I really need to update uh, Nightbot. I've not gone in and updated that in a while, uh, but I need to, because <clears throat> I do have Nightbot on here. Uh, I just haven't updated it. It it should be in my About Me page, I believe, on here. If it's not, then I I'll put I'll put a link in. Uh. Let's see. Right people. Copy. I'll put it in the chat. There you go. Sorry about that. I need to... You know, I have actually been meaning to go in and uh, fix Nightbot. Because there's a few things that I've been like, Oh, I should really change that or do this differently. And uh, I like to change some of the spam filters because some of them are a bit too um, strict. And then I just, I haven't. Oh. Uh, hello, Floatzel. <clears throat> I'm hoping that I can get all of my Pokemon leveled up to 70 before the end, like before too much longer. Here. Heal up. Because that's pretty much all I have to do in this. I just have to get my Pokemon up to level 70. Which a lot of them are doing quite well with getting up there. They're not that far. Only a couple levels. But once I get everyone up to level 70, then I should be up level to fight the Elite Four. Nope. Please, one of you use Magnitude. Okay, we're done. Oh, let me fix that. Uh, mark back. Yeah, I don't know why. I set up a whole thing to... I set up a whole thing to, like, automatically uh, change people to the correct roles, 
and it just does not work. There you go. Now you should have permissions. Yes, I am the war chief. <clears throat> Uh, but yeah, so I, I don't, I don't know what's going on with that. I did, so here's the thing. The bot that I set up to automatically put people in roles, it works for everything else. Um, it works for updating when I upload to YouTube, when I upload, when I get online on, uh, Twitch. Works for all of that. Does not work for setting the roles. And I do not know why. I'm gonna try resetting it up, seeing if, like, maybe I did something wrong. Girder. I do not like Girder or its evolutions. The main reason is in this and in my um, my chonk lock that I just finished, which I haven't uploaded all of that to YouTube, which I really should. Uh, I have not set up the uploads for like the next couple of days. I'm also working on making shorts on YouTube for the entirety of the chomp lock. <clears throat> Which I have the scripts written out for the next four shorts. But I still need to actually record them and edit them. It was actually a really fun uh, Nuzlocke to do. And, uh, I have plans to continue- oh yeah, with that. Uh, because I haven't said this yet anywhere else. I have decided what I'm going to be doing with the Chonk Lock. I will be continuing it in, uh, White 2. Oh, thanks, man. Yeah, I've been uh, I've been working on those. Um, and yeah, I could make you like uh, one of the technically mods. That'd be fine. I trust you with that. You've been helping me a lot with this and giving me suggestions and whatnot. So I don't think you would intentionally sabotage me. <clears throat> oh no, the evil laugh. This was his plan all along. Oh wait, did Pepsi? Pepsi's level 70, sweet. Uh, cream cheese, you're up front now. Um, yeah, I could do that now. Let's see. Server settings, roles. Yeah, there we go. You will be my, my first general. There you go. Yeah. 
Yeah, I mean, as I said, I, I, I trust Jeff. I think that you'll be good about it. <clears throat> Ow. Uh, what was I saying? Oh yeah, so, uh, I will be playing Black and White 2. Bright Dragon type. Mm. Oh, come on. Damn job. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Uh... Ooh, Lamb Chop's level 70. Nice. Okay, that's two Pokemon down. Uh, what is that? Four to go? Yep, four to go. Nope. Switch with Lamb Chop. You switch with Peanut. And that should be all good then. I just come. I know, I'm so close to everything. Oh, wait, I just remembered something that I had to do from last time. Okay, Butter, I, I need you out here real quick. There... There we go. Is that the correct one? Or is it this one? It's this one. There we go. Also, if you're wondering, yes, I just flew around on a dog. Don't question it. I need to give you back. Where is it? <laughs> Actually, let me slow down this a little bit. There we go. I can teach a mice beam. That's interesting. Teach him Thunderbolt? Absol can learn a lot. Hmm. Strength, no. Rock Smash is what I had him have last time, but I want to see what else I got that he can learn. He can learn Shadow Claw, but I... Mm, nah. Nah, Rock Smash is the best thing to teach him. Time to... Nope. I've been playing the Switch games a lot recently, so I, I'm pressing wrong buttons every time I do anything. I do like the Switch games. I almost have the entire Pokedex finished, which I cannot wait till I... Do, uh, do you know what uh, you get if you finish the entirety of the Pokedex for the National Dex in Pokemon Home? Because it is the literal only reason I am doing this. Otherwise, I would not do it if I didn't get anything. <clears throat> Uh, but for anyone, hold on. Let's see. Here it is. Uh. But for anyone wondering, if you finish the entirety of the Pokedex 
in uh, Pokemon Home, you get this. It is a Pokeball Magarna, which is completely separate from, like, a Shiny or something. This is the only way to get this Magarna specifically is by completing the Pokedex in Pokemon Home, which is 1,010 entries. And I am at, I think, 838. I think I said that before, but I am so close to this. Relatively. I have 200 more entries to go, but, you know. Uh, and a huge problem that I'm having right now is... Uh, I think a lot of Gen 2 Mons are not... Uh, at least the starters aren't in a lot of the games. So, having trouble there. <clears throat> I'm gonna have to see how many of them I can, like, transfer into something. Because I do have the Gen 2 starters. I have all the starters. Oh, wait, I forgot to heal Pokemon before I went into this. Oh, well, that's fine. That's fine. So, really excited to get that Magarna. I... Uh, because it's just so cool. And, I, I don't know, I, I like it as a Pokemon because I do do shiny hunting. And it's technically not a shiny Pokemon. But it's... It's essentially one, and the only way to get it is to complete the Pokedex. <clears throat> Which makes it special, and it's like, I really want this, because that is just... I don't know, it, it's a special badge of honor. You know what I mean? Uh, currently, to complete the Pokedex, I am going through... Sword and Shield, which... Am I fighting? Okay. Ugh, I do not like you sped up. Uh, but currently I'm going through Sword and Shield to complete the Pokedex, and I'm gonna be honest, it's not a great game. I do my best to, you know, stay in there for as long as possible for completing the Pokedex. Uh, but in all honesty... Ow. Uh, I can only be on Sword and Shield for like 20 minutes, 20 to 30 minutes at a time, and then I put it down. Sorry, excuse me. Unlike with Scarlet and Violet and Arceus, where I played hours to get the Living Pokedex, which if someone doesn't know, the Living Pokedex is you have one of each form of every Pokemon that is in the game. So you have a Living Pokedex, because you can just go into your Pokemon box and see all the Pokemon that are in the game. But, um... I was able to play Arceus and Scarlet and Violet for hours to essentially get a living Pokedex. And it was fine with me. I had no problem doing all of that. Sword and Shield. Oh, I don't know what it is about Sword and Shield, but I just... I can't. I've tried. I'll go and heal instead. I'm right here. It, I, like, I know a major part of it is the story. I, I hate absolutely hate the story for Sword and Shield. It is so stupid. 
And I can give you a summary of why it's so stupid if you haven't played it. Essentially, the story for... Oh, okay. Essentially, the story for Sword and Shield is... Hey, we want to figure out what uh, the true story behind the hero is. Oh, okay. Uh, and the first town you go to talks about how there is a singular hero. <clears throat> okay. Cool. Who has a sword and a shield? Cool. Well, then, like, the next town you go to is like, oh, no, there's two heroes. And you're like, oh, okay. And one used a sword and the other used a shield. Why haven't you told the other town this? And then you go to the next town. They're like, oh, yeah, so there were two heroes. And they didn't use a sword and a shield. They had Pokemon that used a sword and a shield. And, like, each town you go to, it's not even like this is some hidden information that you find in a cave or something. All of this is, like, here's the information. We have it on a tapestry. We have it well recorded. It is in our history books. But they act like, you know, you're discovering it throughout the entire playthrough. And it's like, but you're not. You're literally just finding out that this entire region doesn't talk to each other. Uh, I'm sorry, that, that's a little rant that I have. Oh, why did I do that? Um, and it's just, it's so unbelievably stupid. Okay, 69. Nice. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry about that. Um, it's just so unbelievably stupid. And then at the end of the game, they have Sonya write a book about how, oh, look at this. She discovered all this stuff and the truth behind the one hero that's actually two. And it's not two people, it's Pokemon. And she writes this whole book that's, like, apparently famous or whatever in the post-game. And, like, oh my god, she discovered all of this. But she didn't. She literally just made the information available to the public. I mean, some of the information is actually locked behind a gym battle. Like, the game is just so stupid with it. <clears throat> Why can't everyone know this? And then she writes a book and there's like no consequences, which I find weird only because a lot of that information was locked behind. Ow. Uh, a lot of that information was locked behind a gym battle and then now it's like, eh, whatever. <clears throat> we'll just tell everyone. Um, but, you know, I'll... Okay, I don't know why I'm at this angle. Weird. I'm sorry, it's just, I, I don't like Sword and Shield. The post-game, honestly, I feel like the post-game had more of a story than the rest of... Uh, surface, I'm gonna get rid of, like, any of you. Is it? I'll do it anyway. Oh, I got a lot of you down to half, so, you know... That's fine. <clears throat> yeah, that worked. Um, the post game is a lot better because the post game is about how, like, I, I feel if the the main game just went off of the story of the post game, it would have been so much better of a game. And the reason for that is the post game is about how Sonya has put out this book. And then these two guys who claim to be the descendants of the hero, or heroes, I forget which, um, are like, oh my god, well, you're tarnishing the, um, the memory of our ancestor because you're now saying that all this stuff that our ancestor claimed he did was actually done by Pokemon. Uh, and we don't like that, so we're going to 
forcibly, uh, we're gonna cause um, a tragedy so that, that we forcibly summon the sword and the shield Pokemon so that uh, we, we can have them as our Pokemon and we can prove to you that we are, you know, the chosen ones or whatever. And it's, it's us. And that's like actually a pretty good storyline to follow, but it's only like 20 minutes of the post game, which is stupid. <clears throat> I've gone on a tangent about Pokemon Sword and Shield for a while, but I just, uh, it's, I mean, I guess I'll continue the tangent. All I'm doing is trying to get all my Pokemon up levels. Uh, okay, what are my Pokemon at? Uh, ooh, lowest is 67. Okay, that's actually pretty good. <coughs> Again, sorry about the cough. I My cough drop ran out. I have another one here. Let me put that in real quick. Because I'm going to keep talking, and then I'm going to just start coughing again. So anyway. It's just, the main story of the game is so stupid. Um, Hop is a terrible rival. Like, he's, he's a Ha'u clone that's worse than Ha'u. <clears throat> also, going back into Sword and Shield, like, after playing Scarlet and Violet and, um, Perseus, it just, it honestly feels like a lot of the stuff in there was experimental. <clears throat> you know, like, we didn't fully bake any of these plans because we didn't know what people would like. <clears throat> And it, it really shows. Um, but anyway, later games had a... The, the games after that had much better stories, in my opinion. <clears throat> oh. I just realized cream cheese is level 70 and I didn't notice. Uh, so we're gonna put melon up front. Oh, and hummus is level 70. Okay, so I only have two more Pokemon left to go and then we can go to the Elite Four. Are you more of a special attacker? No, you're a physical attacker. You just suck with Rock Smash, I guess. Alright, that's fine. There we go. <clears throat> but anyway, so... The later games, like, both the games after that had way better stories. Even though, you know, I couldn't fully tell you what Arceus's story was. I... Uh, on the flip side of that... Oh, okay. Uh, on the flip side of that, it was incredibly fun... Okay, he's the next Pokemon. Uh, Peanut. Psychic. Oh. <clears throat> On the flip side of that, it was incredibly fun, and even if I don't fully remember the story, I, I remember enjoying running through it and meeting all the characters and everything. The characters weren't really the main focus, of uh, Pokemon Legends Arceus, and neither was the story. 
that game was more focused on completing the Pokedex and, you know, getting to the end of the game, which is one of my favorite parts of any Pokemon game. Also, I know I sound a little bit different right now. I think it's because I have a cough drop in my mouth. Which I think when I move it around, you guys can hear it. Oh! Sorry about that. I It fell out of my mouth. I caught it. Man, apparently one of my hairs stuck to it. <clears throat> um, you guys still like me, right? Anyway. <clears throat> uh, so I really don't have any complaints about Pokemon Legends Arceus. Uh, I found it as a wonderfully made game. Um, no complaints. Scarlet and Violet, I do have one complaint. Ooh. Uh, no, you don't need Future Sight. Keep old moves, yes. Oh wait, was that level 70 for them? No, 69. Okay. <clears throat> oh, finally something I can attack with one of these super effective stab moves. Ooh, yay, 68. <coughs> uh, what was I saying? Ow. Uh, so for Scarlet and Violet, the only complaint that I really had with the game was... It... The, the the Team Star story. So, <clears throat> I, I can summarize each one of the stories of Scarlet and Violet. Because there, there are three stories that you follow. And I'm not going to spoil the ending of any of them or anything. Even though the games have been out for a while, you probably should know the ending. But, you know, I won't spoil. <clears throat> um... So, the, the first story is Nimona's story, and it's pretty straightforward. It's just go through the game as you normally would, do the gyms, um, do the events that pop up, battle your rival. Cool, awesome exactly what any Pokemon game is. Uh, so that's fine. No problems there. And they made, in my opinion, they made a very likable rival. Uh, I liked Nimona. I thought that she was a fun character. Oh, this isn't good for you. Ooh, Psycho Cut. I forgot that you had that. Um... So, you know, that story is perfectly fine. The second story is running around beating titans like giant Pokemon in kaiju battles so that you can save the life of a puppy. And it's like, this is one of the best stories. I'm going to say that that one is my favorite in Scarlet and Violet. And then the final one, I won't I won't spoil the ending or anything. But <clears throat> essentially, you can boil down the final one to this was a huge misunderstanding that could have been cleared in a text message. And I'm not even exaggerating with that. Like the whole thing with it is this person doesn't know how to communicate and there's a rumor going around that Team Star is a bunch of bullies. Turns out they're not and you kind of figure this out as soon as you fight the first one, which is the first person, which is why I don't really find this as a spoiler. Um, 
Fuck okay, a character. Reach for the skies. Anyway. Um You you kind of find this out right away, but there's a rumor going around. And then the person who is like helping you take out Team Star is like, Yeah, I heard the rumors, so we're gonna take them out. And then you're like, Well, none of them have actually been that bad. There's one guy who's kinda conceited and whatnot, like He's kind of pompous and whatnot, but other than that, like, he's not a bad guy. And all the rest aren't bad people. <clears throat> so, I, I don't... We don't have to fight them. And they're like, no, we're gonna fight them. And then you're like, okay. I don't think we should, but whatever. And then at the end, it turns out, you know, oh yeah, no, they just didn't talk to people, and they knew all these people, and they, you, you could have just cleared this all up with a text message saying, hey, are you guys bullying people? And they go, what? No, we're, we're not. Everything would have been cleared up. Team Star would have been going back to school, because that's one of the things, it's... <clears throat> We're taking them out so that all their leaders and members start going to classes again so that they're not kicked out of school. No, hummus, you don't need to learn. No, hummus. Keep old moves, yes. Um, but part of it is just... Do I have... Um, I'm just going to use the rare candy for the last levels. Just to speed this up a little bit. Plus, everyone else is getting higher and higher. And <clears throat> But basically, the, the, the last... And here's the thing. <clears throat> I do not understand why in Scarlet and Violet anyone likes Penny. I know there are people who defend her like, oh, well, she's you know, a shut-in so they can relate to her or whatever. But she's, like, not a good person. Her whole thing is she doesn't know how to communicate, which is fine if you don't know how to communicate, you know. Everyone can work on things at their own pace. But she doesn't know it to the point where she actually, like, sabotages people's lives because she doesn't understand... how to communicate and just double check with people. <clears throat> uh, we're gonna move Pepsi up front, I think. Uh, so that, that's like a whole thing with it. That, <clears throat> ooh. ooh, on a hot day, this must be really nice for trainers coming up here. I'm gonna save before I do this. But her whole thing is that she mis she miscommunicated to a degree where it just wasn't acceptable. Alright. Ah, I can't. Okay then. Um On to the Elite Four. <clears throat> Hello. We're the uh, you're the illustrious pineapple, are you? Welcome at last to the Pokemon League. I'm one of the Elite Four people. Uh, people know me as the Fire Type Pokemon user Malva. Here in the Pokemon League, you'll encounter the four of us: the Elite Four and our champion. If you hope to meet the champion and challenge her here, you must first defeat the four of us. Do your best, because if you can't impress us with your real strength, you'll never get to battle her. But it should be a walk in the park for you, right? The hero who destroyed Big Bad Team Flare? Yeah, I'm hoping. <clears throat> just want to see, what is everyone's items? Lucario and I, uh, Mind Play, that's pretty good. I actually might switch you from the mind plate. Let's see what else I have. 
I will switch you from the mind plate. Rocky helmet, that's fine. I gotta switch you because that sharp beak doesn't do anything for you anymore. Uh, I'll see. Oh, right, King's Rock. You can make things flinch. Okay, that works for you. Actually, nah, I shouldn't. Okay. Uh, yep. Give. I forgot to... I got enough follower stars. That's fine. <clears throat> and I got a lot of berries. Okay, I'm all good. Fighting type moves. Uh, nope. Miracle seed, silver powder. Oh, I never did that. Oh, well. Uh, do... How do I poke my boost moves used consecutively? That actually might be good for a lamb chop. Leg, mushroom... I might give this to... Peanut. something what was it up here I'll, I'll give lamb chop metronome who else you're all good you you I need to change uh, item give oh, I don't have the black glasses do I Uh, that... Mm, you're gonna have leftovers. I should have thought about this and done this before the stream, but I completely forgot to. Okay, uh, let's go to you first. Dragon March, okay. Uh, that should be good. You're also my only Pokemon that I know of that can really fight dragons, so. I just realized, uh, do I have any revives? I've got, I've got five revives. Okay, I'm all good. I ran in here because <clears throat> I wanted to get the elite four, and I realized I did not prepare at all. I should be fine. I'm thinking. Why, hello there. This is a really cool Elite Four. I'm not a huge fan of this gen, just because, uh, you know, no one remembers what Team Flare even wanted. Uh, which, I gotta say, going through this again with the... Um, <clears throat> with the, the viewpoint of all of this has to do with aliens or whatever... Oh my god. Does this story become so much better? Hi. But this Elite Four is really cool. I like them. Oh goodness, hello to you. Welcome, welcome, come in. You must be a strong trainer, yes, quite strong indeed. That's just wonderful news. Facing opponents like you and your team will make my Pokemon grow like weeds. 
Why, hello there. I like her earrings. They are probably very heavy, though. <clears throat> Drag algae. Poison. Uh, dragon type. Okay, that's fine. As long as I can get rid of that. Don't die, please. Nope, I'll keep battling. Because I have this. <clears throat> okay. Uh, uh, that's fine. Use Cotton Guard. I want you to. Use it again, please. The more times I use... No... Come on. wherever it uses sing again. Okay, good. Also not great that I got a crit, but whatever. Nope, keep battling. I forgot that they all only have four Pokemon in the Elite Four. <clears throat> For this one. This one, I felt like the gyms and whatnot were really weird because at max, they, at max the gyms had three Pokemon and the Elite Four have four? Really wish you were faster, Lamb Chop, but whatever. Rudigan. Uh, nah, you're fine. Rudigan's pretty slow, actually. But I'm still gonna kill you, because I should. The only reason I kept healing Lamb Chop there is because Lamb Chop is the only Pokemon that I have to deal with dragons. <clears throat> Which granted is uh, on me for not being very... Uh, for not having a lot of forethought. Oh dear me, was I the first to lose to you all? If I've made you feel too confident, that won't be very fair to the others. But I suppose you'd best hurry along to that elevator over there to face them for yourself. Oh, did you have more to say? <clears throat> but yeah, you, you were the first one. Oh, let's see who's next. Let's go with you. And this one is Flood Chamber. Which I think I just keep lamb chop in again. 
I could try hummus. You know what? Hummus. I am going to heal up Lamb Chop, but hummus, you are. I I have like not used you at all this entire playthrough. So you're gonna get some time to shine. Hopefully. You're gonna hopefully get some time to shine. <coughs> oh, I'm sorry about that cough. As I said, it's just a post-viral thing that I, I can't really control. According to what I know, it should be gone in uh, three to eight weeks, uh, and it's been like a week and a half so far with it, so... Hopefully, it'll be gone, uh, end of next week, but, you know, who knows. Okay, uh, what? Right, I gave him the... Got it, okay. Hi. You there, young man, I have a question I must pose to you. Do you think Pokemon battling can be worthy of being called an art? Sure. Indeed. You see, cooking is the type of art that disappears as soon as it is completed. Pokemon battles are the same. Even memories of sweet victory soon fade after the battle ends. To devote yourself entirely to such a life, made up of fleeting experiences, that is truly artful. Plotzer. Uh, I think you are a special attacker. So we're gonna start with Geomancy. <coughs> oh, you are a special attacker, and I didn't expect that. I don't like you anymore. This already went horribly. This is gonna keep going horribly. Such. I just have to be faster. <coughs> oh my god, my cough's getting worse. I guess the medicine that I took earlier is, um, wearing off. Cheese, I need you to stall for a little bit while I heal up people. I am so glad that I turned off notifications uh, for basically everything on my computer. People might find that as a weird statement to make. You're gonna... <clears throat> I need to get rid of this Gyarados now. Yeah, that's a problem. Is 
Thank you for the crit. <clears throat> I did not expect this water guy to be the harder one for me. Okay. My god, stop getting a crit! What the heck is that? He got two crits in a row? Does Waterfall always crit? No, it doesn't. Okay. He just... He got really lucky with two crits. <clears throat> Okay, well, he's... That's fine. He's gonna hurt himself with, um... His next move, anyway, so... You stop that. You stop that. You stop that! Oh my god. You know what? No, do it one more time. <clears throat> nope, you're not gonna. <clears throat> okay, that's fine. There we go. That Gyarados is going to become a huge problem if I let it keep going. Star me. Uh, yeah, sure, I'll switch. Lamb chop. Did more than I was expecting, but luckily that did a lot more. Okay. I was not expecting that much trouble from the water guy. Yeah, okay. Thank you. <clears throat> I... That was actually a huge surprise that the water guy did that much to me. Uh, Geomancy S10, I should be fine. Let's see, is this this ironwork? So steel. So I'm going to want to use... Pepsi or Peanut, depending on the Pokemon. Because I believe they do have Aegislash, which at that point I'll want to switch to Peanut. <clears throat> but for the rest of their Pokemon... Lucario should... Ooh. This whole lead four was just so cool. So well done. <clears throat> Such a shame that it was done in what is seen as one of the worst Pokemon games. <laughs> yep. On guard! Okay. 
And this wasn't a bad Pokemon game by any means. Like, when I say it's seen as one of the worst, I, I want to be specific with that. It's not actually... <sighs> Clap key. I'm going to want to switch out of Pepsi. Um, it's not actually a bad Pokemon game. Like, don't get me wrong. It is a wonderful Pokemon game. <clears throat> The, the problem with it is more on the story side, in which the story... Oh. Screw you, Klefki. The story really didn't make too terribly much sense. I will pass. Yeah, I will actually switch for that. I know that I'm going to get hurt by spikes, but I'm going to have to just deal. <clears throat> yeah, the spikes don't do much in this. I don't do the Mega Evolution, like, basically at all in this game, so I figured for the Elite Four, I might as well. <clears throat> they need to bring Megas back. I'm gonna be honest. <clears throat> oh, did he have sturdy? He had sturdy. Oh, okay. That's fine with me. Keep doing that, buddy. <clears throat> you are literally just giving me more uses of power of punch. Which I just realized I don't even have to switch Pokemon. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Keep battling. Hi. <clears throat> oh, shh, isn't it? Oh, does that not do the same thing in this one as it does in later ones? Okay. That's not bad anymore, then. Yep, just needed to hit it three times. Awesome. Okay. <clears throat> and that is the third member of the Elite Four down. I'm having just about as much trouble with this as I thought I would. Though I did actually have a lot of trouble with the first two. More than I was expecting. Also, I'm going to be honest, if this was a Nuzlocke, which I'm glad it's not, uh, and a major reason why I had this as not a Nuzlocke, uh, which I think I've said previously, is mainly because oh, I needed a break from Nuzlocke's, because the Chonklock, oh my god, <clears throat> the stress that comes with uh, a Nuzlocke. So I do actually... Pepsi would be good here, but I, I want to try hummus again. We're going to try to have hummus in here for longer than five seconds. <coughs> Ooh. Ooh, I like this room. I like this room. It is hot, but you know, that's fine. 
What's up? I like your pants. I also like your uh, top. It's nice. I like the whole sweater look. Okay. We're going to see if I can actually set up with hummus here. Oh, okay. Oh, wonderful. see if I can uh, do anything with hummus or if hummus has just been taking up space in my party this whole time. Okay. Hummus, I was really hoping that you would actually be able to do something here, but come on, man. I, I think uh, I'm gonna have to switch to uh, someone else real quick. Try right, this time. Why? Okay. Bullshit. Bullshit. <clears throat> The reason why I'm saying bullshit is because they were using Hyper Voice that entire time, and then as soon as I switch into a Steel type, they suddenly use Flamethrower. BS. BS. Complete BS. Also, now I'm sad because apparently Hummus, uh, I, I've been having them on my team this entire time, and looks like they weren't that great. I mean, I basically didn't use them this entire playthrough. I think I used them, like, twice. Uh, and that was about it. So... Not exactly surprised, but... Uh, you know. Really wish that they were better. Especially because I do actually like... Um, Smeargle as a Pokemon. I think it's a, a fantastic Pokemon. It has a really creative uh, everything with it. But it, it's oddly just, it's bad. It's not a, a great Pokemon. <clears throat> it can be really good. Definitely can be. Uh, Chandelure. I could switch. But I will. We'll switch to Melon. Let Melon actually have some uh, time in the spotlight. <coughs> We're going to try Hummus being out first against the champion and see if I'm able to sweep.
Fantastic, utterly fantastic. I'll report to all the world the news of you and your Pokemon dominating the Pokemon League. I am a Holocaster star, after all. <laughs> I'm such a busy woman. You'll be facing down the champion next. Okay. Bye bye. Sweet. Tag. Uh. No, have any other maybe items? Uh, use. Do I need this on? I'm gonna check them all. Summary. Oh, uh, you should be fine. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. Uh, mm. No, you'll be fine. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. Okay. I, okay, so the the Elite Four, I've never found them as that, you know, like, oh my god, in pretty much any of the Pokemon games, unless I'm doing a Nuzlocke. When you're doing a Nuzlocke, these guys are incredibly difficult because you have to keep your Pokemon alive. And switching is, like, switching into new Pokemon is incredibly, like, risky. Um, <clears throat> so, it's just like a whole thing of, in a Nuzlocke, you're the child I spoke to in Lumio City in Cor Cow Marie City. Right, yeah, I am. And that means that you are also the one that my, that dear Augustine said, of course, how could I? Oh, I must look like such a fool not to recognize you. You and your Pokemon are the ones who stopped Team Flare for us all. Yes, I did. <coughs> it seems wrong of me to say this, but thank you. You saved us all. <coughs> Hold on. Sorry, I was clearing my throat. Um, yep. But as I was saying, if I can keep healing up my Pokemon, the Elite Four has never really been a challenge to me. <clears throat> oh, wonderful. Your first Pokemon out is immediately something that I would not like to have Hummus out against. <clears throat> God, I'm clearing my throat so much during the end of this. Ah. Oh, okay. Didn't expect him to have that. And he's quite fast. Um, what was it that I was going to say? Uh, I'm gonna try hummus with this. Um, right, so there is actually something after the Elite Four that I wanted to do, which I'm gonna see if it's even, like, a possibility to do it. <clears throat> oh my god. Oh, ooh, does that put you in green? 
it does, that means that I could do this, and I think I actually can set up on this one. <clears throat> I can! I can actually set up here! Sweet, okay. <clears throat> Keep doing that. You're just hurting yourself. Although if he gets a crit, I am screwed. <clears throat> So let's hope that that doesn't happen. This is my second sword dance, I believe. So I need to do one more and then... I think I can survive one. Oh, look at that. I can definitely survive another. That would be, I would have to survive two. I don't know if I can survive two. Oh, isn't it? <clears throat> I'm gonna fully restore him. Okay, did he use up all of his head smashes? Oh, that would be great if he did. I think he did. I think he used up all of his head smashes. Oh my god, I can actually set up now. definitely survive two more crunches unless they crit but uh let's hope that they don't keep using your stuff let my hummus gain in power They did use up all their head smashes. This was a perfect Pokemon to let Hummus set up on. <clears throat> I gotta use Geomancy one more time, I believe. And then, are you serious? Are you serious? All of that effort, all of it, down the drain. Cream cheese, go in. Now we're putting him back in. <coughs> that was... All of that work just to be destroyed by a crit. Now we're going back in here. 
How much do you do? Oh, like most of his health. Great, wonderful. I'm gonna be playing catch up with this this entire time if I keep doing this. That's fine though. <clears throat> Never mind. I'm I'm just moving on. I am moving on from hummus. I am incredibly upset about that. But with two crits, it is very clear the game does not want me to use hummus. <clears throat> I had almost a full setup. Oh, I am so upset about that. I almost had a full setup. I only needed Geomancy one more time. And then crit. <clears throat> that... I'm sorry, Hummus. I did my best to make sure that you would be a good Pokemon. Because I actually really like Smeargle. I also like that Smeargle is... Uh... Ice Rock. <clears throat> I also like that Smeargle is based on uh, Beagles. Because I had a Beagle. Uh, my Beagle's been long gone, but... Um, I think my my beagle passed in 2018, I want to say. Uh, so it's been gone for a while. But I love beagles. Um, I love hounds. They're wonderful creatures. So I really wanted Smeargle to actually have a time to shine in this. Gorgeist, um... You know, you deal with poor guys. But I actually wanted Smeargle to have a time to shine in this. No. No time to shine. At all. Which really upsets me. Uh, Gardevoir. Honestly, I should just keep... I know she's going to Mega Evolve her Gardevoir, and that'll be a problem. Oh, uh, yeah, that's, that's not really a problem. Is this this one shot? No, it doesn't. Oh, okay, well... That's fine. There's a two-shot, and she goes after me. <clears throat> oh, I'm actually quite upset about Hummus. I know I keep bringing it up, but oh, it's just... Come on, game. I wanted to do something fun. But you just had to do that. And it was being set up so wonderfully. Yeah, for Sigmore said he needed to get Mumio City ready for the new champion. But before I take you there, my dear, po my dear uh, Pineapple, would you mind coming this way with me? Uh, okay. It's just... <sighs> At least Hummus will be in, you know, the... here. <clears throat> mm. 
Your love for your Pokemon and the way that those Pokemon gave everything they had in battle for you. Yeah, until you crit them. We'll record them all right here for eternity. Uh-huh. <clears throat> Hall of Fame! Congratulations, Hummus! Congratulations, Peanut! Congratulations, Cream Cheese! Congratulations, Lamb Chops! Congratulations, Pepsi! And congratulations, Melon! This is a weird meal. Some of these work together. Some of these... Um... Like, I'm pretty sure you can cook lamb chops with cream cheese to get, like, a specific flavor. Um... Hummus doesn't really work with anyone. Pepsi, you can drink Pepsi with any of these. Uh, peanut, you could do like a peanut sauce on the lamb chops. Melon, I got nothing for. Melon's just the odd one out. Ah, uh, I mean, on a hot day, a melon and a Pepsi. Yeah, that kind of works. <clears throat> Few days later, crowds of people gather in Lumio City to celebrate the five defenders of the Kalos and the champion. Hello everyone! I am the champ Five Defenders Five I'm sorry, what did these three do? I'm pretty sure it was just me and Sabrina. <clears throat> All of the, these people are here to celebrate uh, you as the champion. Cool. <clears throat> Thank you. I'm so proud of you all. The entire Kalos region, I'd like to say. Do you want to know what? I just have to say... The amount of stuff where I'm like, really, that's what you're saying in this? It's like, ugh. Come on, game. Like last time, where Sabrina was like, oh, we have to understand what Team Flair was doing and come to a middle ground. Team Flair was trying to commit mass genocide of basically the entire planet. There is no middle ground for that. There's either no genocide or genocide. <clears throat> uh, sure. Oh, I have to fight AZ. This giant of a man. <laughs> okay, game. I have hummus going out first. Please. Let me set up. I think it's gonna immediately do flame. Lava plume, okay. Actually, it wasn't bad. Is lava, lava plume physical? I don't think it is. I, can get, I just need to get rid of that burn. This is physical, I know that one. <clears throat> oh my god, is this actually going to let me set up? Come on, let- just let me set up with him. Okay, well- Nope, that is not physical. And it seems to burn every time, which is annoying. I 
I'm gonna start using Geomancy after this. Stop that. Stop that. Oh my god. <clears throat> I don't know how much Lava Plume has, but I can sit here and heal through it. You gotta stop doing it eventually. That time it didn't burn. Okay. Geomancy takes two turns. I'm gonna do Sword Dance. Because until he gets, until he uses up all of his lava plumes, I don't feel comfortable taking two turns to do something. <clears throat> Stop that! Come on. How much PP does the Lava Plume even have? I'm guessing that's his only special attack. Okay, he stopped using it. That's pretty good for me. <clears throat> One more Sword Dance and then I can switch to Geomancy. And then I can just hope that he doesn't get... Ugh, come on. Stop using Lava Plume. How much does Lava Plume have? Actual serious question. I'm gonna look this up. Hold up. How much does it have? 15. Okay. Uh, I, I think that needs to use like at least half of it. Are you serious? <clears throat> really, game? <clears throat> okay, I'm sorry about that. Yeah, I'll switch. And I'll use this time to heal up hummus. We're gonna see what his Golurk has. Oh wait, uh... And this with hummus. You know what? No, we're gonna try. We're gonna try. <clears throat> Come on, hummus. You got this. Uh, 
Uh, no, uh, I clicked the wrong. Pokemon. Uh. I don't think anyone here understands how upset I am that I can't use Hamas to finish this. I just... <clears throat> Don't smile. Every time I was about to be able to use hummus, everything just... Bam! Crit! <clears throat> Part of me that built the ultimate weapon. That's nice. Hey, look, it's your Pokemon coming back. Also, why is it falling from the sky? This, I think, helps prove the alien conspiracy theory for this. <clears throat> so... This one with this alien-looking flower comes down from the fucking sky? <coughs> I need a drink. Also, do you want to know a fun little interesting fact? This, um, this Pokemon here with how its flower looks uh, actually was supposed to be given out in an event, and the event just never happened. Like, there, there's coding... <clears throat> there's coding in the game for the event to give out the Pokemon, but, uh, because the, the event just never happened, they just never gave it out. So, it, it's, a it's an, it's a rare one because no one can have it. But it, it does actually have a model um, move set and everything in the game. Fully, fully fleshed out. It's just the event never happened. <clears throat> that was pretty good. I do gotta say, um... As I said earlier with going through this, I felt like the entirety of the game is greatly enhanced with the knowledge of... Th at least there was a quote-unquote leak, which may or may not be real, that says the whole thing was supposed to originally be about aliens. And I feel if you go through X and Y with that in mind, the entirety of the story is a lot better and makes more sense. <clears throat> Especially because a lot of what Team Flare is doing just doesn't make any sense. <clears throat> but if you look at it from the point of view of their aliens trying to make the Pokemon planet fit them and their environment, and that's why they're doing all this, and using Pokemon of life and destruction to essentially terraform the planet... It starts making more sense. And their whole plan starts to make more sense. Um, there's also how... The, the fairy type gym in this, it doesn't look like fairy type. It, I honestly thought it was going to be a bug type based on how the gym leader looks. But if you look at it with fairies are aliens, then the how the gym leader looks makes sense because she looks very alien and the gym badge is essentially a ufo so <clears throat> you know that all starts to make a lot more sense um but yeah if you just look through this whole game with that in mind then it becomes so much better i'm gonna can i skip through this no, but you want to know what I can do? Because this is an emulation. I 
can speed this up. There we go. <laughs> if you guys want to see any of the people who... You and I were born right here in the same world. Something, something. Great book. Time, the wide expanse of space. So this page. Okay. Oh my god, this is so long! Am I just going to be back in my house now? <clears throat> oh, it just does this. Uh, I'm going to see if... What time is it? No, oh, I got time. I'm going to see if in the time I have left, I, ha I can show people the one thing that I really wanted to show people in this. Hi, Mom. Uh, that reminds me. I received a message from Professor Sycamore. He says he wants to meet you at Lumio Station. Where that is, if you don't, it's just a quick cab ride. I wonder why he wants to meet you now, though. He should have just talked to you at the parade. Uh, he wants to take me to the place that is where I wanted to show people stuff. Bye, Flyboy. <clears throat> I didn't really need him. I only needed him so that I could teach a Pokemon fly. I... I hate Shauna's names. For the Pokemon. Okay, bye! I'm out of here. Fudge. No, please. That's nice. Oh, also, I do want to show people. So, off screen, I did actually, in fact, catch a singular shiny Pokemon. <coughs> Oh my god, okay. I forgot about... Ugh. Forgot about all this that I have to run through. That's nice. <coughs> if you aren't shiny, then I don't care. I'm gonna put on a repel. I didn't expect this to have so many Pokemon in it. Uh, bag. There probably was actually some point where I could go and get uh, my flying Pokemon back, but I. Too, too late now. Forgot about that. Oh well. Okay, I'm gonna use 
this here to get my flying Pokemon back. Great, wallpapers. Organize boxes. That's fine. <clears throat> Come on, butter. I need your help for five seconds. I find it actually ironic that I gave Butter the ability to fly. I... I probably will slip off of them a lot. That's actually what happens when, you know, I'm going down to the ground and I hop off. I'm just actually slipping off of Butter. Okay, organized boxes. Oh yeah, but here he is. This is the one shiny that I caught off sc uh, off screen. I was looking for a shiny uh, Furfrau, and I caught him, and then I named him Pudding. So. In the end, because one person wanted me to catch a shiny and name it Pudding, so in the end I, I did have a shiny named Pudding. I didn't really use him, because... Uh, I never want one I didn't want him to evolve. Bunnelby actually has a really cool shiny in my opinion. Diggersby. Uh hmm. Okay. Mm. She said it's a cab right away, so as long as I can find a cab. Uh do I go to the other side? Is that how I do the cab? No. Uh, yes. Transportation. Lumio Station. There we go. Jesus Christ. Okay. Stop right there. <clears throat> Sorry, sorry. But we seem to be surprising you, don't we? We're just here to give you something the professor forgot about last time. Central Kalos. Coastal Kalos. Mountain Kalos. There are more Pokemon in Kalos than you'll find in those three Pokedexes. Did you know that? Oh, you're, you're giving me the National Dex. Okay. Yep. Cool. You're gonna... Do, do, do. Southern puts a coast. Perfect place for trainers looking to sharpen their skills. So here's your pass for this super. Okay, cool, awesome. Yes. Cool. Do I just? Where where do I get in? Okay, how do I get into this? Do I go up to this? Oh, okay. Yep. There we go. <clears throat> Silly me thinking I'm supposed to go up to the door. Hi. That's right. Oh, okay. That's cool. And then I'm going to heal up my Pokemon. I don't think I really need to, but uh, I will. <coughs> And then let's see if I can find the person who I was gonna, who I want to show you guys. I think it would be up here. I think there's a battle mansion somewhere. If 
friend Safari. I didn't know that that was in this game. Okay. <clears throat> okay, where is the battle mansion? Uh, oh, here it is. I think it's a character that we can talk to in here. I really hope it's not a random chance encounter. That would kind of suck. Okay. Uh, is it a random chance encounter? It might be, actually. really hope I can choose, because I wanted to show this, but if it's a random chance, I don't know if they'll pop up. Uh, do you want to see? Nope. Uh, challenge. I'm gonna do a single battle. Participate. Oh, wait, I can only choose... No, okay. Uh, we're gonna do a single battle, participate. <clears throat> uh, in party, we're gonna have... Cream cheese and first, Pepsi and peanut. <clears throat> That should be a good enough team. Okay. Not you. I'm gonna speed up the emulation until uh, we get the person that I wanted to show. Or if, you know, we don't get them, then whatever. Not you either. Furfrau soloing. I am actually kind of impressed with Furfrau soloing. Not gonna lie. Nope, no, what? Uh, yeah, no, not you. Ruffra was. I made him really fast! Just keep headbutting. Come on, buddy. Okay, I feel like it would be soon, so I'm gonna. Plop this down. <sighs> nope, not this kid. Oh, is this the first person that will cause me any trouble? As Furfrau just headbutts through? Nope. Okay, you know, I I never used Furfrau before, but I'm gonna be honest. 
he's pretty great. <clears throat> a lot of defense, not much special defense, but a lot of defense, a lot of attack, and fast. He's actually a pretty great Pokemon. Hello, Ladyba. Ugh. I really hope that this character that I wanted to show you guys comes up soon. I wanted to show it to you guys in June, but, you know, that didn't happen. Cool. Please? Kirby Battle is just as beautiful. Uh, I don't think... No. Oh, okay. Uh, a little problem here. I can't use Headbutt. Luckily, I just noticed that weird shadow behind it. Ugh, that's strange. We're getting rid of that. Uh, hmm. We're gonna have some problems here. <clears throat> but this is okay. I got headbutts for days. How's that confuse? Special defense, okay. Oh. No! Cream cheese! <coughs> Cream cheese. I'm really hoping this character pops up soon. Oh, Wingle. Okay, well, let's try this. I didn't poison, but otherwise... Okay, there's another one down. It, it's in this uh, battle mansion, or whatever, that you meet this person. Which is why I'm really trying to meet them. And going through these battles as quack, uh, as quack, as quick as I can. Please? No. <clears throat> okay, wait, you know what? I want to look this up real quick. Just to make sure that I am, uh... Can I find this person? Okay, yep, it, it's in the 
battle. I am in the battle mansion, right? Yeah, I am. Okay. And I, I'm correct. It is someone that by chance you will meet in the battle mansion. <clears throat> okay. So I, I'm going to hope that we run into them soon. So I can show this character. Because they're, they're really cool. Like, it's cool that the character's in this, in my opinion. All right. Why did I use headbutt? I have bite. I should have used bite. <clears throat> oh, well. I love that my Furfrau is just soloing the entire battle mansion. Uh, okay. Come on, random chance. Give me the person that I want. No, it's not you either. Okay, uh, configure. We're gonna have this go back up to the increased speed. So that I can get through this quickly. Benefeed. As I said, I'm sorry that this is taking a while. I, it's a character that I really wanted to show off, but apparently they are random chance. No. Uh, Pepsi. Are you serious? Didn't I just fight you? Continue, please. No, okay. Is she like only in double battles or something? Uh, let's see. Got it. I can just... It doesn't matter. I was seeing if, like, she was only in double battles or something. Nope. It's just because it's random chance, I have no clue when or if I'm going to run into her. go.
fine. We're gonna send Pepsi out and... There we go. <clears throat> I did not think it would take... Oh my god. I did not t think it would take this many battles to run into this trainer that I wanted to show you guys. But uh, apparently it, it will. That's fine. I guess. There we go. This is the first person that actually ever gave me trouble. <clears throat> Come on, just give me the person... Oh, this is actually kind of getting annoying with how random chance this is. Because I'm pretty sure some of these people I've fought twice already. do any attacks, so... Oh, okay, I thought I would actually get him there, but... There we go. Continue. Come on, give me, give me the character that I'm waiting for. It's <clears throat> fine. I mean, admittedly, I'm also getting really lucky with, um... The flinches. Wow, this is taking a lot longer than I was hoping it would. Oh, this guy is actually possibly going to be a problem. Oh, okay. Why did I do that? <clears throat> I 
I don't like you stun fest. Sure. In party, we're gonna do the same thing we did last time. Okay. <clears throat> Ow. Seriously surprised at how long this is taking. Why did I do that? Oh wow. He's doing really good at snapping out of confusion. Okay. Good Pokemon. I actually really like Joltek. <clears throat> Come on. I am <clears throat> surprised at how long this is taking. As soon as I run into them, I'll slow down the game and I'll show you guys why. I was so keen on, uh... You know, us seeing this person. Yes. I think I have fought, like, all of the trainers in this besides the one that I wanted to show you guys. No? Okay. That's fine. I don't know what that does, if anything, for Sharon. Oh, still not. <clears throat> Why did okay, well it worked out for me anyway. That's a special attack. I fought like I am one hundred percent certain I have fought everyone <coughs> besides the person I'm looking for. That's fine. Right. 
There we go. I have actually fought everyone. About twice. <clears throat> Except for the one person I want to fight. feel bad about this trainer. This one was just bullying. No, okay. After this one, I'm gonna back out of this and make sure that I'm actually in the battle mansion. Sure. This... I'm gonna go out of here. This is the battle mansion, right? Yeah, okay. I'm surprised it is taking me this long. Okay. Challenge. I'm gonna try for a bit longer to try to get this. I don't want to go for too long because I do... So, uh, just so you guys know, as you know, like, I'm house-sitting, uh, for my girlfriend's mother because they are... Both of them are currently out of town. Oh, my God. Um, <clears throat> but both of them are currently out of town, so I do some house sitting. I made sure yesterday to do all of the house chores that I had to for her mother, so that today I could go to the pool. And, uh, I, I really want to go do that, but I also, I'm not going to do another stream just to show this character. That's why I'm kind of, like, trying to speed through this and get the random chance to get this character. Uh, as I, I'm not going to come back here and do this again. Oh, okay, well, thanks. Fine. I should have used surf. What am I doing? Please, I'm seeing some that I haven't seen before. Just Thank you for showing me, Al. Thank you. Thank you for showing me all these trainers that I hadn't seen throughout my entire playthrough, but please, I just want to see the one trainer. I'm not going to continue after... Well, I'm going to, like, stop the challenge uh, 
at about 20, because then the train is too hard for me to continue. There we go. Please. Game. Okay, and what's your last Pokemon? Quillfish! Ah, uh, okay. That's why I didn't do anything. Uh, okay. Continue. Please? Ooh! Wait, 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 wait! Okay, okay! This is- I- I gotta go into the emulation. This is finally the character. Okay, so their dialogue here is actually very important. The- I've recently remade my life completely. I've been reborn as a beauty at last. So this is actually really important dialogue. Um, as we're going to go into this and we're going to read the rest of the dialogue. We're challenged by beauty Nova and we got to beat her in the battle. And this is, <clears throat> uh, this is actually the character that I was looking for. So, oh, well, that's, I don't like that move because it just halves whatever health you have. Um, that's fine. Oh, uh, okay. Bye, Grumpig. Oh, that's a problem. It's sort of. I, I can handle it. Oh, that's less of I can handle it. <clears throat> that is not something that I expected a Vigoroth to have. I didn't know Vigoroth could learn that. Uh, not Pepsi. You're off as fast. I did not expect that either. Okay, uh, Bone Rush. So, uh, Beauty Nova is... Okay, well that's... Okay, so <clears throat> you know in the beginning how she said like she's completely remade her life, she's a beauty at last? Yes, a mere half year ago as a black belt, quite the transformation, wouldn't you say? So here's the thing for this game, and this is really key for this. The black belt model in this game could only be male. There is no other way. Like, a f the female black belt was a uh, karate kid or a uh, karate girl in this game. A black belt, specifically the trainer class black belt, was male. So this character is one of the only two confirmed trans characters in Pokemon games. Which is really cool. Uh, but yeah, so Beauty Nova is a confirmed trans character. <clears throat>
So yeah. Isn't that cool? That is the character that I wanted to show people. <clears throat> yeah, I, I'm good. Uh, that, is, that is really all I wanted to show people. And with that, I think that's the end of the dog run. Um, I'm going to save again real quick here. But yeah, so I, I just thought that was a cool character that's an X and Y that I could show off to you guys. And not many people get to see them because they're only in the post-game and random chance to run into. But yeah, uh, that is... I, I find that that's a really cool character that they put in. Because uh, honestly, you don't see much LGBT inclusion in Pokemon games. Which I'm not saying is a bad thing. I mean, there's kind of no romance in general in these games so kind of hard to show off any inclusion uh but i find that that was cool the other one i believe is in gen three i want to say and it's a it's again a male to female uh transgender person who became a Pokemon breeder, which in the gen that they are in could only be female. So yeah, it's just, it was a cool character. Uh, but anyway, uh, I think that's going to be it for the stream today. Uh, thanks for being here. Thanks for chatting with me in the beginning, Marpak. That was quite nice. And at least it says I have one viewer, so I'm guessing you're still here. If not, then, eh, well, <clears throat> thanks for being here anyway. Um, and yeah, I hope that you all have a lovely evening. Bye. Uh, for the YouTube section of this, uh, if you like the video, then please like, comment, subscribe. If you didn't like the video, then leave a comment. Let me know. Uh, also, feel free to chat about how... Uh, the, I don't know, if you like the character, you don't. It, if you're just going to be transphobic in the comments, then please don't comment I don't want to hear it um but otherwise uh please leave comments let me know how I could do better let me know what uh could be done to improve my streams or whatever and uh yeah thanks for watching and I hope that you all have a lovely evening. Bye.